What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. On today's video, I'm going to show you guys how I installed the solar street lamp in my backyard. All right guys, so I've previously opened the light just to look at it. I haven't done anything else with it. And um, once you get the box, my box doesn't have any markings on it. First thing you notice is you got your bracket here. You got another bracket that if you can use it to like clamp on certain applications, I'm not going to do that today, but we got some hardware. There's another bracket. Looks like uh, the bracket that mounts the light itself to the pole and the hardware to mount it to the pole itself. There's a remote control in here. Um, some hardware to mount it to like brick. I think the hardware to mount it to the pole itself with some batteries. All right, so this is going to be the basic product information. and what's included in the package itself. This is gonna be the remote control function. And this is uh, all in one. You got your solar panel built into the light itself. You got your LEDs there. And down here, you got a solar street light with a power button that says radar sensor. On the very top, you have your solar panel. Looks like there is a meter there, and probably throughout the day, is you know as much sun as you get, it gets says 20%, 40, 60, 80, and 100. Pretty simple uh, design. Doesn't look very complicated at all. All right, so this is my plan to mount the solar street light. I want to put it in my backyard, and at nighttime we can have light back there. So I'm going to use a four by four post to do so. The mount for the post. This mount here, and this is the same. So we're gonna use this for like a template. It's not gonna work because it's too wide. So I'm gonna take a scrap four by four I have. I'm gonna rip it in half. I'm gonna mark my holes. And um, we're gonna use this right here to mount to this one. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take out uh, half of this one here, half of this one, mount it together with some uh, decking screws. And then this right here bracket will fit on top of the, the pole just fine. All right, so I got a 9 16 wrench and a socket that fits the hardware that they've included with the kit. And I'm gonna mount the light here. I like this one right here so far because there's no extra stuff to mount. Um, just basically four bolts and it's there. And then the next thing we're gonna do is take the pole into the backyard and, and mount it up against the fence. Maybe you guys seen it earlier. I didn't catch this, but it's got a spot directly for the bolt. So. The light itself is going to hold the nut uh, while you're tightening it. So, Now I am doing it upside down, as if you're thinking that. After I get it bolted in, I'll then rotate it. All right, rotate it. There it is, it's smooth. So there it is. And if you see the, the light looks like it's tilted just a smidgen like this right here, but um, I'm not gonna remove those five lag bolts just to get up there. I do have a 12 foot ladder and get up there and, and uh, straighten it out a little bit, but it's not bad. It's mounted. Use five of those lag bolts directly through the fence there. I don't believe it's gonna go anywhere. When we started this project this morning, it was real clear and sunny, it was a beautiful day. So right when we get this right here up, it uh, gets cloudy on us. So that's that's how anything in life is. But there it is. I'll pick you back up once it uh, gets dark. All right, guys, there's the light. It is installed. 
in the backyard there and uh, it's bright for the setting its own right now but once we walk up to it once it uh picks us up on the radar setting it'll get a little bit brighter so let's do that now so here i am you can see it just got brighter so it's got a radar mode on it i think this is pretty bright what you guys think now i do have a light over here on the front side of my house over here that's like the side of my house you see the light just went dim again and uh so this is like a radar mode let's see how bright it is and let's uh turn it on to the auto setting that's exactly how bright it is this uh this illuminates this area really good i think it's pretty bright i like this right here light and everything is built into one uh the power of these led lights just off the sun so i'm able to illuminate my backyard now really didn't have any spot to put it once they reached out to me they said hey would you like to uh review one of these street lights and i was thinking where can i put this thing well i decided to just put it in the backyard here all right guys so this pretty much wraps up today's video it's a great light it's uh very bright i like the different settings that it has i'll place a link to it down in the description below be sure to like share comment subscribe and we'll see you guys on the next one bye